So here's the story. When Google took down $3.7 million worth of assets from me, but that's not even the scariest part. The scariest part is right after that, they came and deleted one of my most profitable YouTube channels that was driving a lot of leads and sales and reputation brand recognition to me. Now, another scary part is that it can happen to you. So you want to watch this and listen to this story to make sure that you're protected. So the problem is I had all my own assets out there. All of my Google My Business listings that were generating drop servicing, sales, paper, call, affiliate sales, CPA marketing, completely wiped out. But they were all mine. And that was the problem. Do you own your own assets? And if you do, that's a danger to you right now. So I'm going to show you why. Google had a Google slap in 2013. I don't know if you remember, but the Google My Business snack pack that used to have seven uh, Google My Business listings in it, it now has three in there. So a lot of you guys missed out on a lot of traffic. And then in 2015, another update wiped out a lot of SEO affiliate websites and everything. And now during the scandemic of 2020 to now, uh, they wiped out a lot of our websites. And as you can see, they tore down a lot of my business. So I had to learn. I had two choices. The first choice was I can give up, stop being an entrepreneur, go cry, move in with my mom if I could and then get some type of job, which I'm not because the name of the channel is Anti-Job University. Subscribe if you haven't. Uh, or the second choice is I can get my Aaliyah on, uh, pick myself up, dust off and try again, right? So that's exactly what I did. So I went to the Bible and the Bible teaches three principles of business. And you're gonna wanna know these, get a pen and write these down. The first one is you have to do some type of unique product creation. Then you wanna figure out how to duplicate the process. Then you wanna distribute it. But after you position yourself uniquely in your market, you're supposed to leverage others. So instead of me creating all of these uh, hundreds of assets that was just taken down from me, what if I leverage other people's assets that are more bulletproof than mine, more uh, you know stable than my assets were, okay? More insured than mine's were, okay? So this is called affiliate. So what I did was I came back, I positioned myself in the market. You do something unique that everybody is uh, find incredible and like, whoa, I can't believe that guy did that. And they want to follow you the same way they follow Yahweh Yah and became disciples. The Bible says, go out into the world and make many disciples of the nation. So once I positioned myself as a leader or AKA guru that can make all this money, people wanted to learn from me. So guess what? If they don't have the money to buy my courses or get in my school, what I did was allow them to become affiliates. And I own my own affiliate network with high ticket courses, high ticket offers, high ticket paper call offers inside there and affiliates in there. Okay, so what I did was I created this army of affiliates now. So now they're using their money, time, talent, skills, efforts, and the ad budgets to bring a lot of sales to me. So if another Google update happens, none of my sites will go down. Okay, I'm, I'm protected. My affiliates are on the front line for me. I have my own affiliate army. You can check out the website, sign up if you want. All right, so I have them giving away money for me and I give them money in order to give away more money for me. Okay, so this is how I recovered from this shutdown or, or attempted shutdown of Google. And that's why I have the eagle smile on. I don't know if you saw that movie or that, but <laughs> that's why I got the smile on because Google thought it was gonna be able to take me out or cancel me or whatever with this last update. And it might think that it did that to you, but now you know a way that you can recover. Affiliates, if you protect yourself with affiliates, these, these people are like insurance for you, all right? That's their job. They go out and you know bring in traffic to bring in money for themselves and bring in money for their clients which would be you, right? So any update or something like that, they're gonna handle it. They're used to that type of stuff. It won't affect or impact your business if you shield yourself with affiliates. Okay, so some of the affiliate networks you might have heard of is Max Bounty, Carefly, Ad Media, uh, um, you know, uh, Ad Mob, a whole bunch of different affiliate networks. And these guys are literally leveraging hundreds of thousands of affiliates that know how to run Facebook ads, know how to run Google ads, know how to rank in SEO better than you and all of that. And they're not going to cry a river like Justin Timberlake if something goes down with their site. So Google tried to slap me, but I be slapped their ass right back. They cannot take me down because the guy be with you who can be against you. As long as you get back up, dust yourself off a Leah style, 
then you're going to be good, right? So that is the story of how they tore down my $3.7 million assets.